Hey guys, so here bringing you another video very quickly. As you can see, we're already in game. Bada bing. Uh, we are playing Ezreal, one of my known or more known picks as AD carry. Oh my god. One trick, one trick, one trick, one trick. I am in a team of one tricks. He's a Shaco jungle main with a 44% win rate. Oh Jesus. Oh Jesus. Oh Jesus. The game, the game name is the sponsorship is for Marvel Strike Force, but again, to make yourself count, you have to download it via my link because that's how they know you're from me. Otherwise, they don't obviously know you're from me. Um, I'm planning so to the YouTube audience, we're, we're doing this new sponsorship. If you can participate download the game and help that'd be amazing um i'll probably do an intro on one of the videos hell it might even be this video that i go hey if you want to help here's the download link um to help in any way you need to download it and get to level seven by base like the minimum to help you need to get to level seven um also yeah use the code in game s m s f6 to get in game rewards as well but yeah, you need to get to level seven. That doesn't it really doesn't take long, like maximum 40 minutes to get to level seven. And obviously it's an eight day sponsorship. So just over a week. So you don't have to do it all in one go. You can space it out if you want to do, do the bare minimum. I'm level 21 in the game. I've been playing it for a couple of nights. Um, so if you wanted throughout the week to get to level 20 odd, that is an extra level of support. Uh, so you get bonuses the more people do. Level 30 is a really big bonus per person. And then also at level 20 in the game, you unlock alliances, basically, in essence, guilds. And uh, there's an extra bonus if we make our own alliance. Um, we make our own alliance and we do a raid, basically. Um, I've made my own alliance. It's invite only. So if you guys get to level 20 and you go, right, well, I will join Huzz's alliance, message me and I'll invite you to the alliance. So we're playing Ezreal, and it actually kind of works quite well considering we have a, a Shaker support. So obviously, I've played a decent amount of Shaker support. I know some people aren't a fan of it. I like it. It just, you have to understand Shaker support. And the understanding of it, it doesn't do a lot in the early game. You need to give it time. And that's fine. And the good thing about Ezreal is Shaker support is a natural roamer. Did I, why miss her Q then? Sweet. I don't even think I needed a heal, but I just wanted to be safe. Oh, it did that do a Q. Honestly, even without the Vi gank, that was still first blood on the Lulu. So that was still bad by the enemy team. But yeah, you can play on the toilet. You know, do whatever. Um, if you download it, help me out. And just literally only play it when you're on the toilet this week you'll get to level 7 easily. So, the bare minimum, you could do that. Boom. Boomba. Oh, nice. Good smite. Oh, Lulu's mid. Why are you mid lane? Like These are the supporters that just don't make sense to me. Lulu's running mid. What are you going to go achieve? Hey, I'm Broken Lizard. 71 months of Prime says you may have engaged. You may be engaged, but our subversary was here first. Love the content as much now than ever, man. Love what you do. Thanks, dude. Oh, I will say um, some people have experienced here on Twitch that their automatically uh, automatic sub renewal didn't automatically renew or something. Double If you're obviously subscribed on Twitch, just double check. It's subscribe, double check it's renewing automatically. Obviously, primes don't automatically renew. Um, but yeah, just double check. I don't know why some people have experienced that, but they have. It was you, Galopa. There you go. Hello. Oh, that's you. So, Shivana's in theory, will prioritize dragons. level 75 
What, in Marvel already? What? been playing a lot i think only new people will count by the way to it just to make that clear as well you're trying to get 20 appreciate it I, I i got to level 20 as i said in only a couple nights also, when I do my own... I'll be doing a stream of it next week. We have to stream it for two hours. So I have to work out how do I stream my phone. So that's going to be fun. Um, they actually have given me a $30 budget as well, which is kind of funny. I've done that. So yeah, I'll be able to buy some things. And I've got a $30 budget that I've got to pay for it, but then I get reimbursed. So I'll take it. We just want to stop the Shivana. We can't honestly fight with how low we are, but just our presence hopefully just makes them go, oh, we can't do it. On auto if i hit the w as well if i hit the w and then the auto would have killed him damn son and the problem with me playing these type of picks by the way if it's not obvious i'm very rusty on them because i don't actively play them anymore <sighs> i've been offered the star wars version of the sponsor uh i don't know I, i'll look into it obviously I'm typically going to try and do one of these sponsorships like once per month because they do help, you know. Um, Little piece of advice. If no one tells you something I put it this way. I don't mind being a bit open and honest. Um, if if this goes semi well and a bunch of you play, I have a base level pay. But also with, you know, if 40 or 50 people get to like level seven and all that. The pay of this sponsorship should break into four, fig four figures. Should. So it's pretty it's pretty good. It's pretty good. Helps a lot. I've seen by from playing aggro they just run away this garen does look to be struggling but people in twitch i think said oh garen's against poppy unlucky so is, is poppy known as a good pick against garen i have no idea like um which is stealth somewhere. Oh, the... oh. I got to get out of range of his E. God, Twitch does so much damage. What the heck? He had no mana, but he just was auto attacking with his ult. Okie dokie. Sneaky sneak. And then he kills her. Never mind. Maybe the early game is rough for Garen. I was thinking, I was like... In my mind, it doesn't make sense. Oh, she ignited! She ignited! A clone! Oh, she's going to feel really stupid. What? This Lulu is mental boom. Isn't she like a smurf, or was that the Twitch? Somewhat, one of them is duo with the... Um, Nice, they panicked. One of them is duo with the Casio and they're Smurf duos. I just can't remember which one. Why needs to go? Oh, hello. That was a crazy early ulti.
That was mad. Hello. I rarely know what I'm looking for, but I always find it. That was a shame Vi didn't come with me there. Maybe I should have pinged. I was like, she is definitely in that bush. Will I only will I only play League when it's my, not my full time job anymore? Will I do variety? I'll still play League 100. percent My my goal of whenever the time comes that I go get like a career job, my goal is to still maintain one video a day on the YouTube channel. Which I know some people is gonna go, "Huz, that's crazy," but yeah, that's my goal. Um, probably do minimum two streams a week, maybe three. Uh, one of them will be an evening stream after like a work day, and one will definitely be a weekend in the day. Uh, for any weekends that I can do it. And I'm not like traveling or anything. Um, so yeah. But I think it'll allow also for more variety. I've not had the interview. The interview is tomorrow. So I don't actually know if I'm streaming tomorrow, by the way. He does so much damage. At least I killed him, but damn. You have slain an enemy. But yeah, I've got no expectations on it. It's my first job I've applied for. Again, I'm not actively seeking a job, you know, if that makes sense. Like, I'm just applying for it because I'm like, hey, that would be pretty good. I'd like that. Why not? That's it. So if I get it or I get offered it. Again, that's the funny thing. I could get offered it and I might say no. I don't know. Um... There's all these things, so I'm I'm basically going into it just in a happy mood. Obviously, I'll have a good chat with them. Hopefully, I'll do well in the answers and all that stuff. But I'm not going there with like I have to get this, which is nice. It's a nice it's a nice position to be in, you know. I imagine in most situations, obviously, where you're doing job interviews and stuff, you're quite like, oh, I need this job. I don't need the job, so I you know. I need to hit the cues. I'm not actively saying what type of role it is. Again, the re the only reason that I actually said in the first place that I've got an interview is because I just... I don't know, I kind of felt like I needed to in a way. The Shaco's not great. Okay, one for one trade at least. Yeah, Prime Minister. You've nailed it. I'm becoming the Prime Minister of England. To be fair, I think I could do a better job. <laughs> this Twitch is insane. Okay. Not really sure why he did that. And Twitch is supposed to be like a late game hyper carry, but he does so much damage in the early game, it's unreal. Oh, is that... So Twitch chat is just noticed, which I haven't. So everyone in Twitch chat has been like, oh, Poppy should be beating Garen apparently, and people have been confused. Yeah, she's building damage, so that's probably why it's allowing Garen to take over. A TP, who's that? Cassio. Hope he's dead again. Echo coming over or no? Where does Shavana go? Eh? Hey, Luchton. It obviously, it shucks for uh, a Shivana not getting any dragons. He just ults out of nowhere. Missed. 
Oh, I'm not playing well. He does way too much damage. Like, way too much. He just gets to stand there and right click. It's the, like Twitch and those type of chat. Like, I like Ezreal, where you actively have to be more active and play a lot more. That's why I don't rate AD carry as a hard role. Like, I really don't. I know people get triggered when I say it, but it's really easy when you can just stand there and mainly right click. It's the, you're just playing a ranged Trindamir at that point. Aaron died. Did he try to dive or something? It, it does worth saying, I like Shaco's support, but in this type of high fighting lane, yeah, Shaco's not the best lane partner. Because he doesn't really, like, go in for all these crazy fights. This Twitch goes for his ulti and Shaco doesn't really do anything about it. Because he can't. Yeah, I don't know. I've never really dubbed AD Carry as a hard role. I've mained AD Carry years ago, you know? Like, I've never thought it's a hard role. It's always confused me that people think it's hard. Ezreal's probably one of the hardest, though, because, like, it's not just right-clicking and standing still, you know? But it's also kind of why I like Ezreal more than the average AD carry. We lane swap probably, right? We should. No point really being down here. Echo didn't go aggressive at all. Damn, that's annoying. We would have outnumbered that in that fight, but Echo didn't go in. Yeah. Aaron picked up the thing. Which is probably about there. Nope, he's just standing in the minion wave. Nice. She was on a shutdown, what? Damn. She was on a shut- uh, I guess farm. This Shaco doesn't think. This is why this guy is a one trick with it, but has a negative win rate. Normal, so Shaco, again, as you all know, I've loved Shaco this year, and like, I find him actually really fun. Mechanically, there's not really mechanics to Shaco, but what you need is decision making and stuff, and like, thinking ahead. This Shaco's not doing that. At all. He's not planning ahead. If you go and watch a pink ward video, my dude is thinking two minutes ahead of time, always. The Shaco's not doing that. Alright, we got the kill though, which is good. I've got quite a lot of gold on me. Oh, we've got five uh, grubbies, so we do a decent amount of extra tower damage. Oh, I just got 300 gold for killing that tower. Nice. Oh. I've got 3k gold. <laughs> God. I hope they don't come fight this. <laughs> I've got 3,000 gold on me. Okay, it doesn't look like they are. Oh, Shivana was thinking about it, but she's way too late. I'm going to go buy. Me need buy. 3,000 gold at 20 minutes is way too much to have. Way too much. 
Twitch is there, yeah. So one thing I would say with this Twitch and Lulu, they're not duo queue, but they are playing like they kind of are. The Lulu isn't magnetizing to Eclipse first sight. What the heck? They're not. She's not magnetizing to anybody but the Twitch. So if you see the Lulu, it basically nearly guarantees the Twitch somewhere is somewhere around in stealth. That echo. Oh my god. That echo. He is really having a bad game. Aaron also got killed. I think he was split pushing too hard. Okay. Let's <laughs> get one shot. <laughs> Why did you go to get blue? Oh, God, he's fine. Don't worry about it. Oh, that was fun. One the shuttle. Farewell, no one do. On a sailor, this Shaco is not great. I wonder how much Jung, uh, sorry, it, like support. So he's got a 44% win rate in 136 games. That is a really bad win rate for a one trick. Like that's probably the, one of the worst I've ever seen for a one trick. But I do wonder what his ratio is. I'll have a look in a sec. So now Poppy's winning again. So that means Twitch is top lane. If you saw the Lulu, they're not doing anything without each other. And hey, look, there, there they are. So Garen wasn't paying attention. Game's really difficult. Come to the box. Big. Don't want to do red. Don't take too long. They're not like randomly two manning bar. Oh no, Shivana's dead. Oh, I just got very rich. Oh, my God. I just got another 3k gold. Oh. Hey, APC Top Hat. 52 months tier one. Hope you're doing good, dude. I'm doing all right. All right, that's straight up Navori. Nice. Again, it's going to be harder for me to carry this game than the Twitch. Uh-oh. So wait, where's the Shaco? Where is he? There. Uh, okay, his ratio. Hmm. His jungle has a worse win rate and and actually has a negative win rate. His support has actually got an even win rate. This Shaco. So that's maybe why he's playing support, but he's not doing I like great. I hit that. If I hit that.
Gonna do Baron. He can get one more kill, that's big, but... Hey, Banana Smoothie with another gifted sub. Thank you, dude. Appreciate it. What I like about Ezreal is so actually I might have figured it out. It reminds me of playing World of Warcraft. Like, it genuinely feels like you're actually kind of more playing a, a WoW champ, like a WoW character, and you've got like a rotation. I think that's what I actually really like. I think I might have finally sussed why I like it so much. It's like an arcane mage. More chance that Twitch tries to kill me, by the way. Depends how spicy he's feeling. Now let's kill Poppy. If we kill Poppy, that's so much of like just don't get caught though. There's so much of their side pressure gone now. And then Garen can region with passive, we go back to mid lane. Oh, that's big. Which also used ultimate but didn't get a kill by the look of it. I'm surprised Vice stayed there, but I guess she wanted to open up the base. This is good. We're splitting up. That was odd. I did damage. There you go. My damage did help actually to get the kill. Oh. oh, wait, what? He didn't get feared. Oh, that was bad. I think the, the fear propped on the poppy. So then it didn't get proc on the shake on the, the on the twitch. I went kind of a bit greedy there because I was like, oh, he'll get feared too. Nope. My bad. But yeah, the base is open in two avenues. We can use that amount of pressure to then get Dragon in a minute. That's fine. It works well, to be honest. I'm really thirsty. I'm going to have to go get a drink after this game. I am a thirsty boy. Shame I don't have enough for Spirit Shojin. Even if I sell that, I'm, lit. I'm still a hundred odd gold away. Uh, oh well. Oh well. What's he doing, man? Genuinely. Genuinely, what are you doing? This Echo is really trying to make this game difficult. Oh, 
guys. That was funny. Alright, we get dragon, so. Does the Echo play? Oh, wait, no, he does. My whole team are one tricks. Literally, they're all one tricks. So this Echo does play Echo quite a bit. The only champ he plays. Don't be there like mad. We I mean, need to just go bot lane, man. That's all we gotta do. I'm gonna get red and then go bot lane. Are you serious? Oh, I try to be sneaky. No. Please die. Thank you. Okay, we could use the the pressure of the supers to kill Baron, I guess, too. Up in th uh, 30 seconds is a long time, though. That Shaco damage is actually getting quite high. Look at Garen, by the way. That Shivana one shots me? Are you serious? Jesus. Well, Poppy's dead. The fact that she went Eclipse. Her build is so bad. She went Eclipse and Sterex on Poppy. I've never... I've seen people go Eclipse on Poppy. I have never seen people go Sterex. The only reason I'm guessing that she's gone Sterex is I vaguely remember people saying it's a counter to Garen. Because basically... Garen's ultimate's true damage, I believe, so it wouldn't help to stop his ultimate. But if you prop the shield just before, it will help you, like... It helps you before he can ult you, basically. Jeez. That is a really stupid poppy build, though. That's just not good synergy on that champion. So she's missing out on a lot of just individual strength. <sighs> Alright, now we do Baron. We've got all three inhibs. Need level 16. I swear that's like the second objective that I've cured this game. Need to get that top in him again. What in the holy Jesus? Oh my god, that twitch damage. Whoa! That's not okay. That just straight up is not okay. That is not okay. Got the poppy. What the heck? We need armor. That was mad. That was absolutely crazy. Echo, I think, died before he could even ultimate, by the way. Like, he literally didn't have... To, well, he did have time to ultimate. I just don't think he expected to get, like, two auto-attacked to, to death. Which, to be honest, fair enough. <laughs> like, no one would expect that level of damage. We run and we roll like two honest sailors. We run and we roll across the seven seas. They need to be careful, lads. They're five people. You are not. Oh dear. They're doing it. A Twitch. Oh my god, dude. Are you sure? Banana smoothie with ten gifted subs. Dude, you're absolutely going crazy today. Thank you so much. I like, genuinely. Thank you very much. Crazy. Thank you.
my god, none of them proc them boxes. Oh my god. That's hilarious. Alright, this should be a free Elder Dragon. They should be basically stuck in their base. And then with Elder Dragon, we go as five people and look to get kills. Savannah might be looking to try and steal, which again, you can't blame her to try. Maybe not. I'm stuck. <laughs> Genuinely got stuck. Okay, she might be trying to come now. I, they won't be able to get here though. Frozen Heart would be nice. And we can't fully commit, because if we use all of our movement and go forward, then t we're very vulnerable to Twitch. genuinely just got one shot wait what twitch did 1600 damage to me and i don't even see when it happened oh we won what happened to me he must have not even got two auto attacks on me i have genuinely no idea what just happened i don't even know when he attacked me that's the funny thing what Rewind that YouTube video and slow it down. Like, I don't even understand what just happened. Ugh. Oh, we're Diamond 3. Ladies and gentlemen, we have officially made it out of Diamond 4 on either account. We've officially done it. <laughs> Woo! I should not be happy about that, but I actually kind of am. So, again, as I said before... I, with being low rating for like a month, I have lost my confidence a little bit in solo queue. So all I'm looking to do at the moment is to try and raise my confidence a bit and get back to Diamond 1. And then when I'm back in Diamond 1, I'll be like, right, I'm a good player again. I'll try and, you know, get master. Oh, are you the Garen? Well done, dude. Good, nice play. Again, I think we were a bit lucky with how bad the Poppy's build was, to be honest. But um, well played. We got honoured by the Garen, who's in Twitch chat, and the Shaco. Because, yeah, the Shaco, he was okay, but I think he was struggling a little bit. But, yeah. We go 11-8-8, 38,000, well, 38 and a half thousand damage. So I do the second most damage in the game, but I'm nowhere near that Twitch. That Twitch is damage. I don't even know what happened in the last fight. I honestly thought Shivana killed me by just ulting me and I died. But somehow Twitch did, what was it, 16 or something hundred damage to me. And I don't even know where. Like, that was mental. But uh, yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed. So again, today we are just playing the old Huzzy picks. So far we've played Darius, Lee Sin, and now Ezreal. So we've got, I don't know, Jace, Shen, um, Arthur's. Maybe even a Nivea, but, you know, I'm kind of doing champions. I'm more, I don't actively play right now because that's a bit more fun. But uh, yeah, anyway, hopefully you guys enjoyed. If you did, do throw a like on it, throw a comment, throw a subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace. Crawl down.